Example 1. The graph above shows how the velocity of a car changes over time. Find the distance traveled by the car in 25 seconds. Click on the answer buttons to proceed. In a velocity time graph, the distance travel is equal to the area between the graph and x-axis. In this case, the graph forms a triangle with x-axis, therefore, the area is equal to half times 30 times 25, equal to 375 meter. Example 2. The graph shows how the velocity of an object changes over time. What is the acceleration of the object in the first and the last 10 seconds? In the velocity time graph, the acceleration is equal to the gradient of the graph. From 0 second to 10 second, the gradient is equal to 15 over 10, equal to 1.5. Therefore, the acceleration for the first 10 second is 1.5 meter per second square. From 10 second to 20 second, the gradient is equal to negative 15 over 10, equal to negative 1.5. Therefore, the acceleration for the last 10 seconds is negative 1.5 meter per second square. The acceleration can be determined directly from the gradient of the graph. However, we need to be cautioned about the positive and negative value of the gradient. Converting a velocity time graph to acceleration time graph. Converting a velocity time graph to acceleration time graph is the same as converting a displacement time graph to velocity time graph, as we have learned in previous lesson. To convert a velocity time graph into an acceleration time graph, we need to determine the acceleration of the motion beforehand. In the velocity time graph, the acceleration can be determined from the gradient of the graph. Let's look at this example. It is exactly the same graph in previous slide. In previous slide, we have found that for the first 10 seconds, the acceleration is 1.5 meter per second square, and from 10 seconds to 20 seconds, the acceleration is negative 1.5 meter per second square. Let's label the scale on horizontal axis and vertical axis. From 0 second to 10 second, the acceleration is 1.5 meter per second square. From 10 second to 20 second, the acceleration is negative 1.5 meter per second square. This is the acceleration time graph corresponding to the velocity time graph.